along with Stan Barrett, I am Linda Cohn. Extensive coverage ahead of Saturday night's ALCS Game 6. But first, Friday night lights on a blue field. Yeah, one potential BCS buster got busted on Thursday night, and another came into picture when TCU beat BYU. Boise State has navigated its way from non-BCS conference to BCS Bowl before, and the Broncos are moving that way again. Taking on Hawaii Friday night, Broncos 29-0 in WAC home games. Boise State assistant coach Jeff Choate getting his team ready to take on Hawaii. Blocking, catching, running, whatever it is, you put your stamp on this game tonight. Every one of you guys was there last year. Every one of you. Do you remember how that felt? Let's bring it out tonight, boys. Hawaii beat Boise for the WAC title last year. Fourth and one early in the game, Anoki Fanaki pitches to Kealoa Polares. He stopped behind the line of scrimmage. Boise gets the ball. They're number seven in scoring defense this season, giving up just 11 points a game. They got a good redshirt freshman quarterback in Kellen Moore. He hits Richie Brockle for the score. 10-0 Boise State. Then later, Fanaki picked off by Brandon Thompson. No receivers in the area. Thompson says, I'll take it. Boise State up 10-7 at the break. Third quarter. Still 10-7 Boise. Fanaki back to pass again. They don't throw it as well. June Jones is gone. So is Colt Brennan. But there's Thompson again with another pick for Boise. And he takes his ball back 25 yards. That will lead to a touchdown. Still third quarter. Fanaki picked off by Jerron Johnson this time. He's taking it back 17 yards into Hawaii territory. And then on the ensuing drive, Moore helps his team cash it in to Austin Pettis. 16 yards for the touchdown. 24-7 Broncos, they struggled on offense last week against Southern Miss, but found their rhythm in this one on Friday night. Early fourth quarter, Fanaki back to pass again, picked off again, and it's Thompson again. Three picks for him, four for Fanaki, and Boise State remains undefeated. They win it 27-7. They're trying to bust into the BCS for the second time in three years, and looking ahead, they play four of their last six games away from their famous Smurf turf. But only three of their last six opponents are above 500 for the season, and all six of them have two losses already this season. Mark May now with more on what it'll take for them to get there. For Boise State this year to gain a BCS bid, they're going to have to finish the season undefeated. That's obvious. But the bottom line is they already have an impressive body of work. They went to Oregon and defeated Oregon at Oregon. Boise State's past also will play in them gaining a BCS berth. They've already been there once before, defeating Oklahoma in the Fiesta Bowl. So for Chris Peterson and Boise State, all they have to do is continue to win and win impressively.